Okay, here we go with the answers. Are we all ready? The correct answer is Captain Tom. Captain Tom has just turned 100 and Lancaster Road was built in 1932. So Lancaster Road is 88. So Captain Tom is 12 years older. The answer is 19. There are three classes from reception through to year four. And then there are two classes in year five and two classes in year six. OK, there were a couple of things there. Uh, first of all, we had the old car park was there. And we also had a nature area with uh, with uh, it was a fenced nature area there. OK, the four houses and the four colours. So we have Dunlin, which is red. Oyster Catcher, which is green, Turnstone, which is blue, and Curlew, which is yellow. Okay, so the comedian was Eric Morecambe. He was one part of the comedy duo Morecambe and Wise, and they sung the song Bring Me Sunshine. Okay, so the first one. The hair belonged to Mrs. Lawton. The eyes be belonged to Mrs. Billington. The nose belonged to Mr. Hart. And the mouth belonged to Miss Hetherington. Okay, picture number two. So the hair with the sunglasses on the hair belonged to Mrs. Seymour. Uh, the eyes belonged to Mr. Redmile. The nose and the hair at the side belonged to Miss Sedgwick, and the mouth was Mrs. Harrison. <laughs> Prime Minister lives in Downing Street, number 10, Downing Street. The largest brass instrument is the tuba. Parmesan cheese comes from Italy. The highest mountain in Africa is Mount Kilimanjaro. Okay, so the five Olympic green colours are, well, it's very, very close to our school colours. So we have red, yellow, green, blue, and the fifth one is black. There are three holes in a bowling ball. So the letter that is located between E and T is R. The way to remember that is that the keyboard is a QWERTY keyboard and QWERTY is spelt out on the top row of the letters on the keyboard. There are 52 cards in a complete pack of cards. The objective is friendly. Okay, in Harry Potter, who presents him with the cake? That is Hagrid. So the person who cycled to Italy from Manchester when they were 23 is Mr. Edmile. Okay, the person who prefers the rain and the cold is Mrs. Guy. Okay, so the person who cut the grass was Mr. Hart, an Everton fan. Ooh. So the Lancaster Road trampoline superstar in our staff is Mrs. Sutton. Okay, the performer who has performed on a horse at Blackpool Tower Circus is, drum roll, Mrs. Gardner. Okay, song number one was Count on Me by Bruno Mars. Okay, the answer to number two is Million Dreams from The Greatest Showman. Uh, and it's sung by three singers, actually. The I would have taken the actor's name 
<coughs> or the, the actor's names or the character's names. All right. And um, so uh, to begin with, it's sung by Ziv Zaifman. That's the actor's name. And he played young P.T. Barnum. And then uh, a little bit later on in the song, it's played by the older P.T. Barnum, which is Hugh Jackman. And also his future wife, Charity, played by Michelle Williams. Okay, song number three is the song mentioned in the earlier question, and that is Bring Me Sunshine by Morecambe and Wise. Okay, song number four is a song recently used by our wonderful Lancaster Road staff for our music video, and that is Shotgun by George Ezra. Okay, question number, the answer to question number five will be very familiar to a lot of you, particularly year six, who performed uh, this song on a video. And um, it was uh, back in the autumn term when they did Shrek, because this is from the uh, musical Shrek, and it's by the cast of Shrek, and it's called I'm a Believer. Okay, song number six is Into the Unknown, by Adina Menzel, or if you wanted to say the character, it's Elsa from Frozen. Okay, number seven is from The Lion King. The song is called I Just Can't Wait to Be King. Um, and you, the characters were Simba, Nala, and uh, the person who looked sort of looked after them on the way, and that was Zazu. Song number eight is Mamma Mia by Abba. Okay, song number nine is High Hopes by Panic at the Disco. And finally, song number 10 is Friend Like Me by Robin Williams. He was the actor or the genie I would have accepted, which is the character from Aladdin. Uh, there we go, guys. Hope you did really well. I'm sure you did. Brilliant brains out there from Lancaster Road. Hope to see you soon with another quiz. Take care, everyone. Bye.